So now we're going to uh, look look at you know the hair grab, and we're just going to look at the hair grab from the front. That's all it is. So obviously somebody's uh, grabbed hold of your hair. Now there's a few options with this. I mean, one is don't put yourself into this position. Uh, but two could be you just hold it and anchor it to your head. You know, so you keep your elbows in. If we move nice and close, so you just anchor it with your hands in this kind of way. Your arms in this way. You're protecting against punches. So if Phil tries to punch me, at least we've got some protection there. And you're hoping that other colleagues can come uh, and assist you. Now, on courses, I often say, well, if the free arm's there, maybe a colleague could take hold of that free arm as a distraction. And then others could really maybe try and untwine the fingers while you hold the, the hand firmly to your head. If you are totally on your own, there are a few options with this. This is more of a general services technique. But you slide up so your hands are over their hand, okay? You need to keep your elbows well tucked in because there's still the danger of punching. But you're taking, taking a step backwards, okay? So you put a bit of duress on their wrist and then bring them down to the floor. It's not as easy to demonstrate this, but so you're reaching, grabbing all of the hands and you're stepping back and you're guiding them to the floor while you stand up yourself. We'll move a little bit closer so you can see the dynamics of it. So we're coming in, we're protecting. Rather than the wrists and just anchoring at this time, it's the top of the hand and just by stepping back. But you're having to step back yourself and you're bringing it down in this, this kind of manner. Last resort. I'm generally not a fan of things like this where you have to bend down because I think you're getting closer to knees, which is a danger. So my preference is if you can hold it, anchor it to your head, You've got alarms where you work, chances are in mental health units, you pull your alarm, you wait for, for the assistance of colleagues, you protect yourself the best way you can. Maybe even having to slide, stand slightly side on so you can avoid a kick or whatever. But it's very much about awareness. Thank you for watching that.